That's a push, not pull, dude. <laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another amazing house tour with your host JP. Today we are in the city of Encino in Los Angeles, California, which is going to be a quick 10 minute drive from Bel Air. The beautiful home that we are going to be touring today is going to feature five bedrooms, five bathrooms, 5,800 square feet of interior space built on a 14,400 square foot lot. This home is currently on the market for $5.499 million. And if you wanted to lease this house, you could lease it for a monthly price of $19,999. This home has some amazing features inside and I cannot wait to show you guys. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So starting off from the exterior of this property, we're gonna see a painted stucco finish featured all around this home. And then we're gonna notice an opaque tempered glass material featured on all three of those garage doors. Each one of those garage doors leads into the massive three car garage space featured at this home. And follow me down this pathway. We're gonna see the cross barred iron entry gate. Let's step inside. So something I did really like about this entry space is all the mature plant life that is surrounding this area. And in this front space, we also see a combination of tall palm trees surrounded with ferns across the property as well. And if you further follow me through the entryway of this property, we also are gonna see some nice wooden accents featured upon the exterior. We also are going to approach what looks like a double door. I really did like the height of this door. However, it is just gonna be a single door. Another feature I did like about this door is the stainless steel accents featured across. Let's go ahead and step inside. So as we first step foot into this property, we are gonna notice custom wooden flooring shown all throughout this downstairs area. And then to my left-hand side, we're gonna see some conspicuously placed French doors. And if we head inside right here, we are gonna notice that this is currently staged as an informal living room. And something else that I did really like about this room was gonna be the floor to ceiling front windows that actually do look out to your front yard area. Very beautiful, let in tons of natural light to this room on a nice hot summer day like today. Also, we do see the recessed spotlight lighting featured right above. And if you follow me down this hallway, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the formal living space featured at this home. So again, a common theme we are gonna see is gonna be those floor to ceiling windows which let in tons of natural light. We also are gonna see more of that spotlight lighting featured across the entire room. If you follow me down here as well, we're gonna see a designated wet bar featured again with some custom wooden cabinetry and a Caesar stone countertop. Again, a common theme of this property is that you are gonna see a lot of the minimalistic staging featured all throughout. And if we look to my left-hand side, we have a nice stone fireplace, which is gonna be a perfect area to relax with some friends and family on a nice day like today. And then if we take a look right behind me, we also are going to see the beautiful backyard space, but we're gonna go ahead and check that out in a little bit. Follow me and let's take a look at the rest of the downstairs of this property. As we continue down the property, on my right-hand side, we are going to see that floating staircase that will lead to the second floor of this property. We see beautiful glass paneling showed all the way up. And also another great feature that I really did like about this property is those massive glass windows that'll let in tons of natural light on the side of this stairway. Also, we have some colorful artwork that really makes the house pop in color. I did really like that. And then to my left-hand side, we are going to see the formal dining table, currently staged again with some of that minimalistic furniture. Again, some very colorful artwork featured on both of the walls, which really do make the colors inside of this house pop. Again, we also are going to see those floor to ceiling glass windows let in tons of natural light and lead to your backyard space. Right here again, we are gonna have one of those pocket sliding doors, which will separate your formal dining area to your informal living room and your kitchen. Beautiful addition in my opinion, I like that a lot. Now we take a look at the informal living room inside of this home. Shown again inside of this room, we are going to see a similar stone material to the fireplace that we did see over in the formal living room. Again, some more colorful artwork shown across this room. Floor to ceiling window lit in tons of natural light. Some more minimalistic staging shown inside of this room as well. 
And if you follow me to my left hand side, we see the large kitchen area. As we're first stepping in, we are going to notice that there is going to be a combination of dark wooden cabinetry and lacquered bright orange cabinetry shown all around this kitchen. And if you follow me further inside the kitchen, something I did really like was the engineering that is done on some of these cabinet doors. So we're going to see a double hinge design which allows for ease of access no matter how tall you are. And similar to the garage door, we also are going to see that opaque glass which is going to be used as a backsplash featured inside of this kitchen. And complementing that backsplash, we also are going to see a lightly colored Caesar stone countertop which stretches all the way down. Something else that I did really like about this kitchen is that recessed ambient lighting shown on the bottom of the cabinetry and on the top as well. It gives a nice illuminating effect inside this kitchen. I did really like that. And something else that we will see is that all of these drawers actually have the soft close feature. You go ahead and take a look right here. I'm going to close that up and it is going to softly close. It is slam proof. Featured right here is the seamless integration of your Sub-Zero refrigerator doors. Featured right here, right below is going to be the freezer space as well. These are going to be on either side of your double oven. And then right here, we're going to see more of that Caesar stone countertop. You have the four burner stainless steel Viking professional stove top. And something else that I found interesting is the combination of all the materials featured inside of this kitchen. Here we're going to have an extended breakfast bar with designated seating for two people. We see that orange lacquered material right below which adds a nice pop of color atop that stainless steel countertop. Now let's continue on and if you follow me down here we're going to have the walk-in pantry currently under some storage right now but definitely a lot of space for storing your snacks and all your food. Now as we further step through the downstairs of this property, we're going to go ahead and take a look inside of the guest bedroom feature down here. To my left hand side, we're going to have your closet space with a full body mirror. And then inside of this room, we're going to have that same spotlight lighting that we did see in some of the other rooms featured on the downstairs. And note that they actually did fit a king size bed inside of this room, which makes it ample for storing any other items that you would like inside of this room. This bedroom is also en suite guys, of course, let's go ahead and take a look really quickly. So here we see more of that Caesar stone countertop. We see the floating vanity with ambient lighting featured right below. Also some more lacquered material cabinetry. And right here we have the glass enclosed shower space. Shown with some lightly colored tile extending all the way to the top of here. And then to my right hand side, we're also going to have a doorway which leads out to your backyard space. And we'll go to check that out in just a little bit. All right, stay tuned for that. Now follow me outside the guest bedroom, follow me to my right hand side and we take a look at the designated washer dryer room. In here we notice that same Caesar stone countertop that we did see over in the kitchen. Also tons of cabinetry in here as well, perfect space for all of your clothing. Let's continue on down here. To my right hand side we have the powder room. So featured inside this powder room, we also are going to see some ambient lighting shown below the floating vanity and right above the mirror as well. Here we also are going to have a stone material vessel sink right here. I think that really was a nice touch inside this powder room. Makes it look a lot more luxury in my opinion. Let's continue on outside. Let's go ahead and step inside here really quickly. This is going to be the designated three car garage inside of this property. We fit one car, two car, three car right over there. And we see those three separate garage doors as well. And then to my left hand side, we have the push to open coat closet shown again with some more of those stainless steel accents upon the doorway. And now follow me and let's go ahead and check out the beautiful backyard of this home. Come out these floor to ceiling sliding glass doors. follow me down this concrete pathway we're going to be led to your beautiful pool space take a look at that guys that is incredible so as we're stepping inside this backyard we notice beautiful bright green grass shown around this entire pool space and something again you guys will see are those massive trees that surround this entire area adding a very great element of privacy inside of this home and as we further walk through we see a nice statue surrounded by more bright green plant life beautiful, serene, and relaxing environment shown inside of this backyard space. Let's go ahead and continue down and check out the designated hot tub. Beautiful open space here in this backyard. You can play sports, you can relax with your friends. It's amazing. And to my left hand side, we have the hot tub area. Beautiful integration seamlessly connects with your pool space. Amazing. 
As we continue down here, we see more very open space. And then to my right hand side, we have a seating area under umbrella, seating for four. And over here, we are going to have your outdoor barbecue area and a heat lamp. And notice right here, this is the pathway that actually leads over to the guest bedroom inside of this property. Beautiful outdoor space. You have tons of space to do tons of activities. You can play sports out here, guys. You can relax with your family, invite tons of guests over, have some get togethers. It's amazing. Absolutely beautiful. Follow me back inside the home and let's go ahead and check out the second floor of this property. Follow me up your floating staircase. And as we continue on up, follow me to my left hand side. Another great element of this property are the glass panel type of balcony that is shown right above your staircase. Also we see tons of natural light coming in from that large window. Continue. More glass panels featured on my left hand side. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the first bedroom featured on the second floor of this property. See we have nice sliding glass doors which let in tons of natural light to this room. We see more minimalistic staging. This room is en suite of course. Let's go ahead and take a look real quick. We see another floating vanity shown right here with another Caesar stone countertop. Then we have a glass enclosed shower bathtub combination shown with some multicolored tiling. Let's continue on. And now right here we have a full size walk-in closet space, tons of storage for all your clothing and some jewelry and accessories. And follow me to my left hand side again. And we go ahead and take a look at the second bedroom shown on top of the second floor of this property. So here we're gonna see some more sliding glass doors that will lead out to a nice balcony that overlooks your backyard. Let's go ahead and check that out real quickly. Here we have beautiful views of your backyard space. Amazing, serene, beautiful. I love it. So featured again inside of this room, some more minimalistic staging. Similar to the other room that we just saw, we see another full-size walk-in closet. We step inside here real quick. We see the exact same bathroom just flipped around as the last one. Another glass enclosed bathtub shower combination with that multicolored tiling. Again, with a floating vanity right here as well with a Caesar stone countertop. And now let's continue on. I really love the open concept featured inside of this upstairs. Let's go ahead and check out the third bedroom of this property. Follow me to my right hand side. This room is currently staged with some gym equipment shown as a designated gym space. We also see some more of the nice sliding glass doors which lead out to a nice balcony. This room does let in tons of natural light through those windows as well. And if you follow me right in here, this room is en suite, featuring a similar bathroom to the ones that we did just see over on the other side of the upstairs space. Again, we see more of the floating vanities with that Caesar stone countertop. Right here, we have another glass enclosed shower space with some more multicolored tiling. Some more natural light to come in through those windows. Very beautiful, I really like that. Inside this room as well, and take a look, we have another full-size walk-in closet space, another perfect opportunity to store more of your clothing and accessories. Let's go ahead and take a look at the master bedroom featured inside this property. Now follow me outside this bedroom space. Right above me again is a beautiful skylight, led in tons of natural light. Now let's go ahead and step inside of the master bedroom inside of this home. So inside of here, we notice tons of open space. We see more of that minimalistic staging and then right over here, we see another stone designed fireplace. Again, we see beautiful tall windows that let in tons of natural light and actually do show out to your beautiful backyard space. Amazing. As we further step through this room to my right hand side, we have a designated informal living space. Again, we see some of those sliding glass doors which lead to another outdoor balcony, similar to the one that we saw in one of those bedrooms right over on the second floor of this property. As we continue on down to my right hand side, we have the his and hers closet space right here. Tons of open space. Definitely a great opportunity to store all of your clothing, accessories, shoes, all that good stuff. Let's head into the master bathroom of this property, guys. We have a beautiful floor to ceiling glass enclosed shower space. 
if we take a look inside really quickly, we also do see a beautiful skylight feature which lets in tons of natural light during the day. Really like that. And then to my left-hand side, we have another floating vanity with some of that wooden cabinetry and a Caesar stone countertop. And then directly in front of me, we have the master spa bathtub right here, which allows for beautiful natural light to pour inside of this bathroom during the day. We also have a nice view of your backyard space. Very beautiful, love this one a lot. Also, we see some more of that spotlight recessed lighting featured above us. And that is going to wrap up our amazing house tour of 4850 Andesol Road, located here in Encino, in beautiful Los Angeles, California. If you guys like this video, please go ahead and drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. Let you know every time I post a brand new house tour, I post a beautiful new house tour every Friday at 11 a.m. sharp. Stay tuned, we got a lot of content coming, so please stick around, all right? I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. See ya.